I'm telling you right now, the kid's got to go. He knows. He knows how to. He knows that we know. This is a decision that's going to be made between me and Jag. <laughs> Corey's days seem to be numbered, but I really, really hope that they decide to target Cam before Corey. Right now, who boy. For sure. If Jag says no, I'll do it. I'll go with. I'll go along with it. I know what really needs to be done. Mm -hmm. I'm, it, dude, there's only so long that you, this like. I only got so much money to go to the casino with, and I've lost all my money but my last five dollars, and I'm gonna put it on this table right here. And you see, the thing is though, I just want to say this though. But the problem with this house this year is that one minute they make us believe that they're gonna go, they're gonna take this person out, and the next thing you know is this one. Because remember, Bowie was talking about Siri and Felicia. It wasn't then. It wasn't until Matt then mentioned Corey. No, no, it wasn't then until Matt then mentioned Cam. Yeah, and then later on, we then saw Jag and Matt talking about Corey. So there's like, how many targets right now? You know what I mean? Like, this is the issue here, but oh. If they take my $5, I'm the dumbass. I could walk out right now and go buy a cheeseburger. Oh, my time. And the house is going to take my fucking last money. Yeah. If we keep giving this kid rope, mm. he's playing us. My he's time. been playing us. Says the one that's been that's been winning HOH and veto back to back pretty much for the most week. The same guy who's been nominated for eviction more than anyone else is still in the house. Okay, <laughs> I was saying he's wrong, but yeah, he knows what we're doing. If he doesn't, I'm giving him too much credit, and that's okay. I'd rather err on the side of caution. You know how he goes off for like hours and thinks in a room by himself. I think he's not even sleeping. He's he's he's, he's mustering up the plan. He's uh, America will tell you all. I personally think that there's a possibility Cam may fear Corey. He may be worried about Corey. Because, I mean, look at it this way. Who is the biggest competitor against Cameron right now? Who is it? Okay. And if you ask me, I think it's probably Corey. I don't think anyone else really comes close, to be honest with you. Um, I mean, if we're talking about physicality, then obviously it'd be Matt. But if you're talking about generally speaking, intelligence, all that kind of stuff, it should be Corey. It should be. Um, so, yeah. But okay. <laughs> you guys let me know what you're thinking down below. You know what I mean? Come on now. And uh, we can talk about it.